a million dollars? I'm rich! Hey everybody, I'm London. Welcome back to the show. Guess what? One of my dreams just came true. I just acted in a commercial. Check it out. Looking for the perfect mortgage? Turn to the nerds. It was so much fun. I met some great people. There was some awesome food, which they call craft services. I got my hair and makeup done. Now strike that pose. And I even got paid for being in the commercial. Money dance, money dance, money dance. Yeah, yeah, money. Maybe you just acted in a commercial and got paid for it. Or maybe you get an allowance for doing a really good job cleaning your bedroom. Maybe dear old sweet Grandma Jackson sent you some money for your birthday. She's so sweet. Or you found a million dollar check in your backyard that's mysteriously addressed to you. With checks like those, shoot, I need to play outside more often. Now you may be tempted to go buy up all the candy in Walmart with all the money you're making from your allowances, birthday parties, and commercials. But trust me, that is not a good idea. Uh, ow. Uh, I never should have bought all this candy. Clearly, that was not smart. So, here are five smarter things that you can do with your money. Number one, save it. You could put it in a piggy bank, a wallet, or do like I did. Get your parents to open a bank account for you. Number two, give some to charity. St. Jude and Charity Water are two of my favorite charities. But let's say you like bees. You can donate some of your money to help save them and the honey that they make. Number three, buy something for yourself. Like slime! Hey, it's your money, so enjoy it. Number four, you could get a gift for someone that you love. Hey, baby, Grandma loves these pearls you got me. So beautiful, so beautiful. Now, since your parents got you saving money, I mean, that's all good, but I have to ask. Are these pearls real? I need to know. I don't want them turning my neck green or causing me to have more bumps because you know about these bumps lately. Well, Grandma love you. Bye. You see, our parents, annoying baby brothers, and even dear old sweet Grandma Jackson like gifts too. Number five, you could start a business. You can use your money to start a lemonade stand or a huge lemonade company like me and the bees. Hey, Michaela. Now here's your assignment. Ask your parents to open up a bank account for you. Then you can save your money until you decide what to do with it. But whatever you do, don't buy all that candy. Ow! Ugh. Those are just five of my ideas. But if you can think of anything else we could do with our money, let me know in the comments. I'd love to see what you come up with. If you loved today's episode, please hit that red subscribe button and give me a thumbs up. Well, that's it for today's episode of London in America. Until next time, always remember to be you. Peace.